All right, let's fire this thing up. Hey Bert, what if we use this bulkhead to kind of hide the new batteries for the air conditioner unit? I think it'd be a great idea because the ABYC says do not put the batteries in the cabin with you. Good point. Well, good deal you made it. Hi, I'm John Graviscus. This is Bert Dell. Bert, say hello to everybody. Hey everybody. It's great to have you back aboard the boat with us again. What we're riding around in is our 1983 25-foot pursuit project boat. And this craft has a cuddy cabin on it. And until recently, you've never been able to have a marine air conditioner as a creature comfort for boats like this. You need a boat typically that's large enough to house a generator. And this one isn't big enough. But what we're going to be looking at today here at Shipshape TV is one of the big marine air conditioning companies and how they have developed a marine air conditioning system for boats like this with the use of 12 volt batteries and something called an inverter. Now we're going to take a look at the actual system, all the components of the system. We're also going to show you how to do the installation and wait until you watch this week's In the Engine Room segment. We're going to show you no matter what type of marine air conditioner uh, that you have on your boat, how to maintain it so that you get years and years of trouble free service. But guess what? Before we can get into any of this stuff, shoot, you know the drill by now. You see, we need to work out a little trade-off. We've got to get all of you to spend the next 30 minutes with us as we're working and kind of sweating right here along the beautiful water's edge. And then in exchange with the aid of a few of my very knowledgeable friends in the marine industry, we're all going to be pooling together in order to do our very best to let you in on a few more ways to make your boat ship shape. And Bert, yeah, I think this is going to work out well. Shipshape TV, America's favorite boat improvement show.